Hi guys, Rick Damon with the Cowtown USA. Here in Cuba, Missouri, here with the 2015 all aluminum Silverado. Eight wide, seven six tall, 16 foot short wall with a slide. Now I would call this a hard loaded trailer. It is, uh, it's got a hay pod, drop downs all around. It's got your enclosed uh, nose here in the front, uh, your power awning, your fully armor plated from the front here. Runs all the way to the back. 17.5 radial tires. They are nitrous filled and they're aluminum wheels. All that means to you is they're supposed to last 30% longer and run 30% cooler. We've been through brakes, bearings, to extra load light here on the side. Nice drop down doors. You can see the thickness of them, construction of them. Flow through uh, head shields, fully insulated. Roof fence in the horse compartment has the pass-through door. See the lid on your on your hay pod. Okay. Step back here in the back. I mean it doesn't look like it's had a lot of use. The interior looks very, very nice, fully padded, fully lined. I mean the walls and stuff are in excellent shape on it. You talk about some ventilation, drop downs in front that flow through dividers and head shields and behind as well. Okay, bring you back over here. It's got your main presents. You can see all the way through so if you need something extra long you can. Saddle racks are not only removable and adjustable and this uh, rear tack compartment is also collapsible. Uh, saddle pad bars here on the door. Load light here over the back end of it fully insulated and fully lined back here in the back. Let's see here. Got your aluminum floor. Alright, and I did mention the pass-through door. Okay, I'll swing you around here on this side of it. Got your uh, ladder that goes up to your hay rack. See the how nice finished doors and the big manger doors manger it has two mangers and the full escape door separate face bars in front of the front of your horses you got your drop down step and again we mentioned the full escape door with the drop down door in it water here there landline hooks there you've got your uh i like this one i just have the one valve in here because you can you can run your your black water and then pull the handle right behind it and it flushes it out with your gray water. I, to me, I think that's the best idea. Okay, now a lot of these trailers, guys, will not have your uh, sliding windows on the end of your slide. This has got it. Makes great uh, uh, cross flow ventilation. It's your, your fresh water tank. In fact, uh, looks like it might even have two. Fresh water connection here fresh water connection here and city water connection here so you can hook up to the to the water hose all dark tinted glass again the nose is covered all your gas tanks battered everything is is uh, protected has your hydraulic jacks right there okay now I'm gonna take you around okay we're gonna walk right here by your uh, your water tank um, your hydrant you carry your water from home. A lot of the horses don't like to drink that that strange water. Okay, I'll take you in. I did mention power on it. I'll mention it again. Have a light here as well. Got a 110 hookup here, so you can sit out here with a box fan or a stereo or a, a cooker, anything like that. It's got your screen door. Uh, really nice floor that I'm tracking up here. Okay, you got a couch. I'll just step to, toward the back end. I'll give you a look. See here. Now this camera looks like it's got a yellowish tint to it. It is not yellowish. It is. It does. It does look nice. Couch looks like it's never been set on. Swing around here. Nice deep vanity makes into a bed. Both the units make into a bed. Okay. And you up the wall here. Scrolling here, comes across here, got storage here, yeah, storage here, and, and then your uh, valances are all wrapped. 
kind of like a basket weave. Soft shades. You got your extra lighting here. All right, now you got your your uh, privacy curtains here, privacy rod run across it. Okay, now a big thing in these campers is is uh, closets. Okay, to the left you have a hanging closet. To the right you have a clothes hanging closet. You got storage to your right, storage to your left, and storage across the front, and more lighting up there. You got a 110 plug-in up over here if you need a CPAC machine or whatever you need. Okay, now I'm just going to, I like this step here, how they recess in there, it makes it easy, easy to get in and out of. The older I get, the more I appreciate that. Okay, I want to kind of give you a view from here. I mean, the couch is perfect. The floor is perfect. Okay, now I'll give you this view. All right, you've got more storage cabinets. Access there in that cabinet. Now to your left is another hanging closet with drawers. So there's your third hanging closet. Okay, flat screen TV, and it is on a, looks like it's on a swivel, so you can swing it around and watch from the, uh, from the dinette or the couch. Your big fridge, freezer on the top, fridge on the bottom, more storage up over the top. And this is pretty neat here. Right over the top of the stove, you got a crank up vent. Let's put heat out. Okay, now, this has been upgraded to a convection oven. Most of them have a microwave with this convection. And more than just being taking a place of a, of a, of a gas uh, oven, it actually lowers it when they do that. So you're able not to, you're able to actually see what you're doing. Okay. Got your covers over your sinks, makes you a, a uh, large place here to prepare your dinner. Okay, more closet doors here. I kind of like the color of this too. It's a two-tone. Uh, kind of like a rubbed look. And I'll mention this too. It's ducted AC and ducted heat. Kind of show you the back of the bar here. Wraps all the way around. Okay, then you got your drawers. You can't never have too much drawers and storage. Okay, now I'll take you into the bathroom. First thing you're going to see on the right is a vanity. Mirror, and then right beside that is another closet. Okay, now this closet can be shelves, which this one's set up, or you can take that out, and it has, well, you can't see it's so dark in there, but it's got a hanging rod there as well. So if you want to hang clothes in here, you can do that as well. Then you're going to go here to the left. Okay, let me see if I can get more light. There we are, more lights. Okay, your pass-through door, and they've added hooks here. Okay, now, then you know, to your left, you got another huge closet. They call them walk-in closets. you got shelves, shelves, rod, and rod. So another big closet. I mean, this dude has got closets. This is going to, you're going to be able to take this and go places and stay. And I guess that's what people are doing so much, headed west. And another, another fan up over your head as well. Kind of give you a, a look around, look see. Nice big radius shower and, and a little bit more headroom with the skylight over your head. And your heat vent coming out there on the floor. Stool there. Okay, and I stepped in here to the horse compartment again. You can see all the the all the flow through for the air. And if you don't want flow through, if you've got horses to fight, we can put something over this. We can put poly over this. If you want if you want to separate them, we can do that for you. That's not a problem at all. Fully insulated. I mean, when you drop this down, drop all these windows down and this insulated ceiling, you're going to see probably 30% cooler, 30 degrees cooler, I should say. I like that big radius shower. No little dinky, no little dinky showers. Nice deep vanity cabinet. Okay, and it's got your <coughs> got your uh, power fan in it. Let me get my glasses on here. Okay, it's called a fantastic fan. You control the speeds up and down. It's got your rain sensor on it, so if you leave it open and it starts raining, it is supposed to close. 
Okay. Give you one more look see in here, kind of from this view. Lots and lots of room. Lots of living room. Lots of living room. Again, 2015 uh, Silverado, all aluminum, eight wide with slide. I think it's uh, about a 16 foot short wall. Couch and dinette, which is really handy. You don't have to make up your bed so you can sit down and have something to eat. Anyway, this is Rick at Cowtown USA. Give us a call, 573-885-6300. Ask for uh, uh, Sean or ask for Jack, either one. We'd be, any of us would be glad to help you. We offer financing. Uh, if, if you need that, if you qualify, we've got it. But again, fully armor plated from front to back, which makes this trailer stouter. Takes a, well, it'll make the trailer last longer. Dual hydraulic jacks, dual propane, dual batteries, stainless steel nose. The trailer is a, a charcoal metallic gray with some gray, dark gray and black charcoal striping. The trailer is very pleasing to the eye. It pulls good. It pulls good. I pulled it this morning. Anyway, 573-885-6300. 573-885-6300. Cowtown, USA, Cuba, Missouri. Our watch your television show, RFD Women's Pro Rodeo Today. RFD Women's Pro Rodeo Today. Thank you.